Hi, I'm Mindy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the reading habits tag and I was tagged by Edie Lewis Reviews and I'm filming from a new spot today because my library is packing central because I'm doing some last minute um, pre-filming so that I will have a video up for the last little bit of my trip. And yeah, my library is a disaster, but I'm doing a quick tag and I'm just holding the phone. So I'm hoping it won't be too shaky and horrible. <laughs> so the reading habits tag, first question is, do you have a certain place at home for reading? It's actually right here where I'm sitting <laughs> on my couch. That's where I do most of my reading at home. I do read some in the bed, like before bed, or when I wake up in the middle of the night and can't sleep. I'll read a little bit in bed, but mostly not nearly as much as here on the couch. Question two, bookmark or random piece of paper? I have a huge collection of bookmarks that I've gathered over the past years, and um, it would just be wasteful not to use them, <laughs> right? Question three, can you just stop reading or stop after a chapter or a certain number of pages? I have a very hard time trying to stop um, reading anywhere. Uh, I love to stop at a section break or a chapter break. Question four, do you eat or drink while reading? Drink, yes, especially coffee. Eat, no, I don't want to get jam hands on my books. Question five, multitasking. Music or TV while reading? Yes, I have a hard time staying focused on reading if I don't have some other noise going on at the same time. Weird, I know, but my attention span is quite short. So multitasking is kind of my thing. Number six, read at home or everywhere. I mostly read at home. If I'm on a trip, I'll read wherever I am. If if I'm somewhere other than home, I listen to audiobooks if I'm in the car or something, or jogging or whatever. Question seven, one book at a time or several at once? <laughs> I read several at once, a whole bunch of books going all the time. Actively reading usually two physical books, one ebook and one audiobook just to keep it fresh because that attention span thing, again, I'm constantly switching. Number eight, reading out loud or silently in your head, mostly silently in my head. Sometimes I will read something out loud just to see um, what it sounds like, especially with dialogue or a really interesting voice <laughs> of a character telling a story, I might read it out loud just to like get a better idea of what it sounds like. Number nine, do you read ahead or even skip pages? No, I read the whole book. Don't want to miss anything. <laughs> Number 10, breaking the spine or keeping it like new. I try my hardest to keep it like new. Uh, sometimes the longer the book, the harder it is to keep it like new. Some spine breaking sometimes happens. What you gonna do? And number 11, do you write in your books? I do not write in my books. I never have. And uh, I use sticky tabs sometimes to mark interesting places, but that's about it. 
and I don't always do that either. It depends. Something especially beautiful I might mark. And that is the reading habits tag. I hope you are having a fantastic summer. <laughs> and I should be home from my vacation very soon. And I should be back to my library very soon. <laughs> so I guess I will see you then.